hello guys you are back with our next lecture okay so in this lecture let us continue with the next question guys so there is a small correction in this options guys so it is a nothing but a big o of log base 2 n guys similarly it is big o of n and it is nothing but big o of n square guys so there is no power it's not written clearly and this is a big o of n square log n got it yes so now let us start understanding the question okay okay so n items are stored in a sorted doubly linked list okay so here they are being 100% clear so it is a sorted and it is a doubly linked list wow i think this is the first question which we are facing right with respect to doubly linked list nice so 1 2 and 3 it is sorted so they, they did not say whether it is in ascending order or descending order okay so for a delete operation a pointer is provided to the record to be deleted so basically if you want to delete a particular node you are having the address of it so here in this how much time what is the time complexity of delete guys if you observe so you can delete an element easily so the only thing is you need to bypass it right so basically you will update this pointer to connect to this and this pointer to connect to this done right so the middle element will be lost so the time complexity of a delete is a big O of a 1 remember okay for a decrease key a pointer is provided to record on which the operate operation is to be performed okay so here they are creating one more operation that is nothing but a decrement key so what decrement key will do guys so if we are having a three value if you call that decrement key, it will do minus one so in that way it will do some operation but there is a small catch for it guys what is the catch here the question is it should be a sorted means if you decrement one value so the list might be shuffled it's true right yes so that is a catch so that is the reason why the decrement will become big o of n so basically it depends on the list so so indirectly we should sort it right so once you decrement so this decrement will take only a single step of execution but after decreasing you need to sort the element so what is the worst case guys it is nothing but big o of n only right so for sorting a array right yes so that's the reason why it took a big o of n okay so after that they are saying an algorithm performs the following operations on the list so big o of n that is nothing but n delete operations okay so into n similarly log n insertion operation so what will be the cost of insertion guys okay so let me think okay so if i want to insert a node here what i need to do i need to link this to here this to here okay so that's a cost of a one if i want to insert it in middle so i'll be linking this to this okay so that's also cost of one so basically that also will be cost of one but insertion we are doing for log n time so it will be into log n okay so you can write big o of also so it, that will also work okay similarly find operation so if you want to find the worst case will be big o of n so here they gave a log n nice and the decrement is nothing but they are giving again log n okay sorry again uh, big o of n okay so now we got all the values okay so what is the time complexity of all the operations put together so just to add them what's there in that right so big o of 1 into n that is nothing but big o of n plus decrement is nothing but big o of n square plus big o of log n okay plus uh, big o of n log n okay so i think we did not discuss about algorithms till date right yes if you are watching currently the live lectures it is it's not discussed yet guys so that's the reason why you will be thinking that what will be the answer then here this option is there in option this option is there in option and this option is also there in option you will be asking me what will be the answer the simple trick with this complexity is whenever you are adding multiple complexities among them all which is maximum guys so this is the maximum one right the worst case of worst case this is only right so that is the reason why this will be the result guys that's it so the option c will be the correct answer got it yes so the only thing you should understand here is so the decrement operator will take big o of n square because if you decrement one value it will automatically unsort the list so you need to sort the list in a proper way so at that time it will take some uh, some complexity right so that is big o of one so that is the main reason why it became up to n square guys got it yes so i hope everyone got a clear idea on this so in the next lecture let us continue with the next question thank you thanks for watching like share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this thank you